commend my colleague Dan Corcoran. We all know this has been an emotional case for the Wilson family. They have had to relive this on paper, now relive that tragedy back in 2010. Dan, you spoke with some of the family members today. How are they holding up? Well, of course, as you said, very emotional before and after this verdict was rent today inside the courtroom and also outside the courtroom. That's when I had the chance to speak with Scott Wilson's mother, who's been watching this trial from the very beginning right up through the verdict today. Hey, Tracy. A mother's relief moments after a jury convicts John Goodman of DUI manslaughter and vehicular homicide. Lily Wilson, mother of Scott Wilson, embraces prosecutors Ellen Roberts and Sherry Collins. Shedding tears, Wilson's mother leaves the courthouse and offers this. I think everyone's ready for the healing process. Um, it's going to take a long time, and I don't think anyone has really had an opportunity to heal because it's just been nonstop with everything that's going on. Um, a lot of emotion, I'm sure, for both sides. Um, and it's something that happened a long time ago. It's been two years. Are you thinking about Scott today? Obviously, yeah, a lot. Yeah, I was thinking with the whole engineering presentation, um, Scott, come help me. You know, you, you just got your engineering degree. Come help me understand exactly what this, and then I'm thinking this is about Scott, so. And Jay, today we also heard from a spokesperson for Scott Wilson's father, attorney Scott Smith, who said, of course, his client very pleased with today's results. And now he says the family can start moving forward, start the healing process. Dan Cole can continue our coverage. Dan, thank you very much. for.